Hi, I'm Theo from Theo Cooks, and we're doing barbecue season at the moment, and today we're going to do a gorgeous Argentinian-inspired churrasco dish with gorgeous sirloin steak and a bit of chimichurri sauce. So when I was travelling around Argentina, we couldn't get enough of this stuff, and it's a really nice dish to have, and it's a great thing to do on the skewer as well. So, how do we make a chimichurri sauce? Grab a load of parsley and give it a really fine chop. So that's our parsley done. Um, and then some tomatoes. I'll probably use two cherry tomatoes for this and into the bowl. Piece of garlic. Good pinch of oregano. Um, we're going to do a little bit of white wine vinegar as well. Some good extra virgin olive oil. Want a pinch of chilli flakes. A bit of squeeze of lemon. That's done. Gorgeous piece of sirloin here. I've already seasoned it with a bit of salt and pepper. And we're going to chop this into chunks for our skewers. And I want these quite big chunks because we're going to sear them really fast. You know, I like my steak pretty much rare, virgin or blue, so I just want a really nice coating on the outside and that's it. Not too much because it's going to sear, it's just to give it a little bit of an accent of flavour. Stir that round. Should have used a bigger bowl. In fact, it's bloody ridiculous doing it on this size bowl. So let's pop these onto a skewer. In an ideal world, you know, you'd probably leave these, I guess, you know, for an hour or two to soak in, but they're going to have plenty of flavour. We're going to dress them anyway, so I'm not too bothered about that. And that's our skewer. Let's get cooking. Our churrasco sirloin steak is done and it looks great i mean you can see the charring on the outside you can tell just by squeezing it it's still quite tender inside so it shouldn't be overcooked at all and um, we've got some of our dressing that we made earlier our chimichurri and let's just give that i'm not going to drizzle it over i'm just going to put it on the side so i think you can dip in as you want let's cut one of these bad boys open Now, I don't know if you can see that, but that is going straight in my mouth. Look, this is everything I want in a barbecue, to be honest. Really nice meat, charred on the outside. She's got a bit of that caramelisation. Pink and rare and moist in the centre still. So I'm Theo, thanks for watching. Now, hope you enjoyed it. Check out the rest of the barbecue series that's on at the moment. Uh, remember to subscribe to uh, the YouTube channel, or you can check out theocooks.com for loads more recipes. Thanks very much. Cheers.